Okay, so it looks like it got here finally. Finally arrived. Um, information unlimited. I ordered some high voltage stuff. And, um, should be interesting. Okay. I think this is how you open up the box. Gosh. Let me just rip it here. Oh gosh. Let's see what do we get here. Okay. Oh, I believe it's a high voltage power supply. You want to be careful with the razor blades because you don't want to nick the high voltage cables that could cause them some problems okay oh okay very nice let's see these are input 12 volts 1 amp output 2000 volts AC 12 volts in DC, 2,000 volts out AC. Let me get these out of the way. Actually, mm, not sure why it came with those capacitors. I'll have to look at that. Okay. See, 12 volts DC input, 1 amp max, and 2,000 volts AC output. Uh, okay gas tube uh, power supply. Okay, should be interesting. Oh, there's a couple caps on that one too. Okay, we'll have to test those out a little bit later. See how they work. Okay, so here we have our um, information unlimited uh, gas tube power supply. Model X8. Uh, and I have this battery, I did a video on that. I like this little battery, lithium battery, and I got my scope hooked up here and I just wanted to see what frequency this thing works at. So, right now, no power is applied to it, so I'll hook up the power. As soon as I do that, we start getting a waveform. Just so remember, just have to bring the scope probe close and it will pick up the, uh, the voltage. And uh, let's see, I already put the cursors on here. And it looks like our cursors are at about 55.6 kilohertz. And it's definitely high voltage because I'm just bringing the scope probes close to this and it's, it's getting very big signal. Okay, so I'll have to do some testing with a voltage multiplier because that's why I got this. And uh, it should be interesting. Anyway. Okay, just I wanted to do a quick check on the high voltage capabilities of this. Again, I have my lithium battery, it's super light. So this makes the, everything portable. And uh, <clears throat> 12 volts into this. <clears throat> and I just have a neon light hooked up with one lead. Since it's high frequency, it should light it if it's high voltage. And there we go. Look at that. Okay, so definitely high voltage coming out of that. I don't think I have a probe that does the 2,000 volts, I'd have to look around, but uh, I believe it. It's definitely a high voltage, high frequency. Anyway, this is uh, Dr. Jane's, and thanks for